break a brick, get a trick. I drift Fiji water. I'm on an island with a yellow bitch, might be your daughter. I pop a titty in your mouth. Hey guys, so I am back with another motherfucking video, hoes. So today is Christmas Eve, and I just have so much to talk to you guys about. Cause as you guys know, I did, uh, I started doing the 25 days of Christmas makeup looks. I was uploading every day, but I wasn't getting the desired amount of views. So I tried to like, this up some more. You guys don't comment and tell me what you guys wanna see and things of that nature. So I really just go off views. That's how I know what to post and what not to post. So if I get a lot of views on a certain video, then I'm like, okay, I need to start doing videos like this. And if I don't get a certain amount of views, then I'm like, okay, I need to go away from videos like this. So the 25 days of Christmas, I thought that was something that y'all would like to see. And I thought that would help improve my subscriber count because you know, the YouTube algorithm is really fucked up right now. So I was like, you know what, 25 days of Christmas, that I'm getting subscribers because I'll be posting every day. But you guys weren't watching it. <laughs> that was the downfall. Y'all were not watching the videos. So I got to a point where I was just like, you know what? I'm not doing it. And I didn't give you guys a heads up or any of that. And I actually did post a video. Not post. I actually did do a video after the the day after the uh, the last one that I, post, that I posted. But it was an everyday look because I had to go to work that day. I didn't do any eyeshadow. And I know you guys don't want to see two everyday looks. Like, that's pointless. So, I was like, I ended up deleting it. And I was like, you know what? They're not going to want to see that. So, I ended up scrapping the whole 25 days of Christmas all together. Because clearly, y'all didn't like that. Y'all weren't feeling it. Because if y'all was, I feel like I'm too close. If y'all was feeling it. Y'all would have watched the videos and y'all didn't watch the videos. So that lets me know that y'all don't like stuff like that. So that's why I had stopped to doing the 25 days of Christmas. But like I said, today is Christmas Eve. I got a new wig and this is King's Velveteen. Like, look at this hair. This is my, oh, sorry guys. This is my raw Indian straight hair that I just wand curled. Um, you guys really need to follow me on uh, Instagram and add me on Snapchat because I had my photo shoot. I need to go into the hair looks. I mean the makeup look because I'm talking too much. But I had my um, photo shoot for my hairline a couple days ago and it was crazy. We had some back screen footages but it's not enough to make a vlog. I really should have been more like like recorded more so in the background but I was doing hair and makeup so I can't really do it. So yeah, but the looks were amazing. Um, so follow me on Instagram at King Mokota Y and two A's. Add me on Snapchat at Queen Polka with a V. It's lit, y'all. Y'all need to follow me because that's where I upload everything. That's how you can get all the sneak peeks. But my hairline, King's Velveteen, like I don't know if I told you guys, but it is registered. The launch date of King's Velveteen is March 9, 2019 at 12 a.m. Central Standard Time. So have your card, your credit cards ready. Okay, guys, have it ready because it will be popping. But this is my new wig. I'm getting better and better with plucking and lace melting each and every time. Like I just get better at it. Like my scales are just growing. But yeah, this is the raw straight here, wand curled. I had wand curled it for the shoot too, but that was the days ago. So them curls have been fail. But they the curls held for three days though, so <sighs> that's a good thing. So my hair can hold a curl, guys. It can hold a curl. If you guys would add me on Instagram and Snapchat, then y'all would know because I was keeping y'all updated on stories and shit. So, what am I gonna do today? I feel like all the colors of the fucking rainbow are so outdone by me because I've done a lot of them. And now I'm just like, what colors am I gonna use? That's how I feel at this moment. I guess I'm gonna go with like a purple. Cause I'm really tired of doing greens. I feel like I've done green way too many times. So let's go in with the purple shade and the Juvia's Place palette. Yeah, guys, I'm so excited for you guys to see 
well to well yeah see the hair i was gonna say get the hair but it's, no but that too get the hair if you guys are interested this hair is bomb y'all um i sell straight curly and wavy hair raw hair of course and i have i, I feel like this video is gonna be all over the place because i feel like you know you know what i think i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna just like do my makeup and then post another video just talking about my hair because I'm really excited and I'm very happy. I'm very joyful. Of course, it's holidays, so I'm very happy about that. And I feel like I've been very blessed 2018, so I'm also very happy about that. Um, I just feel very happy. Um, this year, I've gotten very close to God, so my relationship with Him has strength, strength, str I that. My, relationship, my relationship with God has gotten really strong this whole year, I've always been a Christian, but I never had a personal relationship with God. So this year, I really took the time out of my days, I guess, to really just build a relationship with him because I never really had one. So this year has just been really amazing to me. I've been up on my prayers. I'm not going to lie. There was a couple of days that I, I would miss, but I tried to pray every night. But I feel like 90% of the time I did achieve that. Um... So I feel like because I prayed so much and because I've gotten so close to God that I've just been highly favored and blessed. So I'm very in a good mood and I'm in the Christmas spirit. If I keep looking outside, I, I can't help it. It just looks so good for it to be December. It's usually cold around this time of year, even though I live in Dallas. But I'm just very happy and I'm very blessed. So I feel like I need to do a separate video because it's already seven minutes in and I'm ranting. I haven't even gotten to the makeup look. So I'm just, this video will be focused on makeup. And then after I'm done with this, I'll get into the whole hair, my life. An update, I guess you could say. Because I feel like on this channel, I don't really talk about my life. It's just more so like I talk about drama and Nicki Minaj and Asian Doll. I think a lot of times when I talk about Asian Doll, I end up editing it out um, because the videos be too long. But um, I haven't really talked about me. Um, and I really want you guys to get to know me. Um, I'm sorry if I'm saying um a lot. I'm just going off the top of my head. I don't. I was going to make up this. Uh, I'm ranting. Okay, so this video will be makeup next video so if you guys are interested in my hair brand kings of a team then watch the next video because i may upload them on the same day i may not y'all know how i am so i'm not going to give you guys any promises but this will be makeup i probably won't even talk i'll probably just put some music over it because i'm not in the mood well i'm not, not i am in the mood but this video is going to be really long if i talk about my hair and my life and all of that so yeah let's get into the makeup look so I'll, let me shut the fuck up i do not like sleep under my covers anymore one is hot as fuck in this house so i'll probably fuck around and die trying to sleep under them damn covers but i got me a blanket so now i just sleep on top of my covers underneath the blanket that way i don't have to make up my bed every day and it's really been working for me so yeah I feel like I'm so I'm like running out of makeup looks especially when it comes to these colorful makeup looks cuz I feel like I just outdid blue and green so I'm really not trying to touch those then I really want to do a pink look but I don't have like a different shades of pink. I want different shades of pink. I think I'm gonna go into my archive and pull out my cheap eyeshadow palettes. But well, one thing I know how to do is do what I do. So I have like three pink shades. One, two, three. So I'm just going with all those three, all those three shades. So I can get the desired look even though I don't know what look I'm desiring as usual. I never know what I'm going for. Do y'all like my hair though? I feel like I'm always doing the middle part. So I was like, you know what? Let me do a side part. Oh, y'all can't even see. Let me start on this eye first. Y'all can see me better on this one. How about the weather where y'all living though? Cause Texas doesn't get too cold. It's not like Detroit or Chicago or New York or anything like that. 
but for someone that's lived in the south their whole life has never really experienced snow or blizzards or things of that nature um it's cold out here but it's not as cold as it usually is it feels like fall right now and i think we've had like a bipolar i mean of course texas is called the bipolar state because you can never predict what the weather is going to be like out here one day it'll be super hot next day it'll need a jacket then it'll be hot again they will need a fucking coat but I feel like it was summer of course then after summer we experienced like a little bit of winter a little bit of fall a little bit of summer again a little bit of spring I feel like this this the fall and the winter really were like interchangeable like the fall was really winter and the winter is really fall that's how I feel I mean the, yeah I said that right that's how I feel cuz I'm like this shit is not making any sense because it feels way too good like the sun is out last year it wasn't like this for christmas it was a little more bleak <laughs> so to speak y'all if y'all can see this palette right now the way i am digging into it <sighs> gotta get that pigment though so now we're gonna go back in with the purple because I feel like excuse me I feel like I got a little lost well not a little it did get lost so I need to go back in to deepen that up and lately I've been working with a lot of blacks and I usually don't like black because I'm scared of it because it can be very overpowering like if you don't be light-handed with black you can really ruin your whole look and then plus I'm dark skinned so I feel like dark skinned girls look best with bright colors when it comes to eyeshadow on their eyes instead of I mean dark skinned girls yeah I said it right dark skin look dark skinned girls look best with light colors like brights like colors like these instead of blacks like I feel like that makes us look like raccoons and I still feel that way but I feel like if you do it the right way and you don't pack it on you'll be fine so, I'm learning each and every day. This is the shade we're gonna go into. The pink one and the Zulu palette. And y'all, I just got this palette and it is dirty. I'm really bad at, oh, I'm just gonna blend these two together. I'm really bad at like, um, keeping my palettes clean. I'm the worst at stuff like that. And I really do try keep them as clean as possible but it's a struggle because I get my hands really dirty when I do my makeup So let's go in with this blue, this silvery blue shade. Let's go in with that. I'm gonna lay it down. 
Ooh, my voice crack. <laughs> I did it look like this before. Damn, y'all. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to um, change it up. See, I told you, I don't be fucking knowing. I've done a look like this already. So, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go in and change the glitter. even holding on anyways see y'all this glitter is not holding at all I'm going in with my gold this is cute because this is a hot ass mess and I've already did this before I'm just going to have to go in with this I've already used it brush is too fucking dirty so I'm gonna just go in with the the primer the glitter primer and I'm gonna just y'all my hand looks like a fucking cosmic brownie these fucking squirrels squirrels are out of fucking hand Go in with this. Know what I'm gonna do? Ooh, shit. Okay. That's okay, great. guys. So this is the final look. I am sitting in my bed because I was on the phone with my mom, and my stomach started hurting. I feel like I got a shit, so I'm in bed. But this is the final look. I don't have any lip stick or lip gloss on. Y'all know I usually don't have any on. That's fucking powder. Don't mind my saggy ass titties um but yeah shop kings of a team y'all we are too lit of course the frontal is not mine i do not sell frontals i just sell bundles but yeah i have a 16 18 and 20 inch in so yeah, I put um, some gold highlighter in my um, waterline. Take some fire ass pictures, post them to the gram. I love you guys. Ooh, my arm's starting to hurt, y'all. But I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in to this video. Um, I hope you guys shop with Kings Velveteen. When I launch, my launch day is March 9th, 2019 at 12 a.m. Central Standard Time. I will be keeping you guys updated and posted and give you guys a whole bunch of sneak peeks and different looks or whatnot of the hair. Um, yeah, y'all. Thank you guys for being on this journey with me. Shout out to all my day ones because this channel is only going to grow and get bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay, guys. This is the glitter I put on. It's blue and gold as you guys can see right there it's a little fucked up but I don't feel like fixing it so it just will have to be fucked up but I love you guys thank you for tuning in I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and talking my shit tune into the next video